Oh! Okay, so, um, I'm not sure if I, if this is just gonna be another part of the video or if I started uh, a new video, but here I am nonetheless. And, um, I noticed that to fight the boss that I wanted to fight, I needed to be a blizzard. If I want to farm the stuff, I need a blizzard. If I want to find the boss encased in a thing, I need to have a blizzard. So, uh, in the meantime, until I wait to get one of those, I will see if I can make some interesting stuff, maybe. Some armor sets or whatever, I don't know. Um, I can make the soil staff. Yeah, sure. So I got 100 dirt, and let's go and create a dirt minion. <laughs> I will, uh, yeah, I'll meet you guys at, at the, uh, what's the face? At the. Ooh. 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 At the, uh, whoops. <laughs> Got the stylist instead. I will meet you guys at the, uh, at the crimson, of course. Alright. Let's, uh, oh, it's actually soil armor. <laughs> okay then. Uh, let's make this sort of stuff. What's this do again? There's one more damage for every 100 blocks of dirt in your inventory. Good. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, right TV. It is being annoying again. There we go. Let's see. Uh, what do you summon, eh? What does thou summon? You summon little dirt dudes. Which do something. <laughs> Not sure, I'll have to take a look at what attacks they do. Otherwise I might actually maybe <laughs> Maybe use them. <laughs> I don't know. Um let's see. I'm I just noticed that I got this thing. The uh, Zebra Shadow Tail Butterfly. It's a very It's an endangered species! No, uh, it is a special butterfly, so I will be able to use it for this boy. Let's go make some iron armor. Uh I should have a buttload of iron ore. There it is. <laughs> that took a long time. Um, I have one piece of these things. Uh, of these things, yeah, of this. Armor set. Well, I have two pieces right now of the same. Well, the same piece of. But then just in another freaking form. There we go. Let's go and make the iron chainmail. And let's make the iron greaves. Okay, so all that together. Now I need the iron shield. Which I can make. Alright. Next up, the thorium shield, which means that I'm gonna probably need a thorium anvil. Yep. How do I make a thorium anvil again? Uh, where are you? Because I know I collected some of you. Uh, thorium anvil needs an anvil and thorium. <laughs> Duh. Let's go. Yep. Anvil and thorium anvil. Um, that's fun. Nope. Nope, you don't fit over there. <coughs> you should over here. Okay, now I can make some thorium. I need to make the shield, which needs an iron skin potion and five of these boys. One, two, three, four, five. Got a thorium anvil? Yep. Let's get myself one of me iron potion, iron skin potions that I get over here. And let's summon the uh, slime. <laughs> there you go. Bam. Got the freaking shield. This is used in the iron enchantment, of course. The shield of Cthulhu. I need an iron broadsword, an opal staff, an anvil. So I'm going to need another anvil. Okay. I'm going to have to get some opals. E How many? Eight. My god. What luck. What fortunate luck. I'm also going to need an iron broadsword. Probably going to need more iron. There you go. Yep. There it is, the open stuff. Okay, so I should have everything, right? Uh, yep. Alright, let's go to the, to the crimson again. Oh, sh <laughs> ah, jeez. Fall damage. Um, what am I missing? I have an opal staff, I have an iron anvil, I have a zebra thing. I have the shield of Cthulhu that's over here. 
All right, bam. Iron enchantment. Strike while the iron is hot. Allows the player to dash into the enemy. Right click uh, to guard with your shield. You attract items from a large range. Effect of the iron shield. Well then. Cool. So now I regen. What the hell is this? Whoa. I can right click the block. Huh. Intriguing. Ooh, I like this. I very much like this. And this gets turned into the steel enchantment. Am I getting all the steel stuff? Super anvil? I can actually get this stuff. And not the spike racer though. Can I make spikes? Dungeon token stang. Hmm. Cool. <laughs> I like this. Okay. Uh, let's go and quick stack some stuff. Uh, where is the box with all the critters over here? Nah, my PC. The silk enchantment is one I can make, maybe. Ice cube, eighth plague, <laughs> cure, and this thing. I should make this guy though. Uh, some silver and one butterfly. Can you stop, PC? Uh, let's go and get some silver. There you go. And an anvil, and I can make myself a butterfly charm. While in inventory, exotic butterflies will spawn. Good. Keep trusting. Uh, I'm gonna drop the soil staff. It's pretty cool, but at the same time, I don't really care too much about it. Okay, I'm gonna get thrown in there. Lottery ticket. Let's go and get another die, maybe. There you are, strange dice, thank you. Or strange pants, reflective obsidian again. Mm. Isn't that amazing? Ooh. This is the reason why I was holding the back end up here. Yep. I don't think I've gotten here before. You're a, sh a, a shallow, no, a swallow tail. That's from. <coughs> That's from Torium. Surprising. I really like the fact that I have this extra health, by the way. Yeah, got him. Hmm. So I can technically make the silk enchantment. This is only used for the butterfly staff. You are used for. You are. <laughs> yes, you are used for um, this thing. What the hell does this get? This turns into the sacred stuff. Sacred stuff is made with hallow charms. Oh, that is hard mode. Okay, this is getting annoying. Let's see. Oh, wait. Um, wait, 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 wait. I'm not sure if I caught you before. Yes, I did. Okay, um... Let me take a look at some things. So, no, not this one. This one. So, if this thing turns into the sacred enchantment, and then the force of Alfheim. Yeah, this is all the Alfheim stuff, or like all of the... Thorium stuff. And I have the Soul of Yggdrasil, which is all of these freaking... Uh, Helheim, Asgard... Wait, is this... This is Norse mythology, right? I think it is. And then this gets turned into the Soul of Eternity, of course. The true might of the Nine Realms is yours. Hmm. I like. I definitely like. Okay, um... So, I still need to go and see about making some weapons. Either making or getting some weapons. The butterfly staff, mayhaps. I need any tier 1 butterfly. Let's see. Uh, butterflies, butterflies, that's over here. <coughs> hmm, I'm gonna need one of these. So I'm gonna hold on to one of those. Um, I think I'll go and use one of them. Uh, this thing and wood. Wood. There be wood in here. Yep. Okay, can I make this thing with a couple of different ones? Yes. Bam. Butterfly staff one. It does eight summon damage. The latest in butterfly technology summons three random butterflies to attack your enemies. 
Well then. There's eight damage, eh? Um, I need to find the target. <coughs> to use this on. Because I wanna know, if I get rid of these guys, am I gonna... Wow, these are a lot of freaking butterflies right now. Got them. Wait, exotic ones? Do they mean the thorium ones? I think they do. Yep. Sulfur butterflies. I have no idea what all of these butterflies are, by the way. That's one thing that I don't really know that, much, that well. Hmm. Oh well, I'll just you know, I'll run around with these butterflies because I think they're cool. <coughs> they also go through walls. <coughs> Not sure if... Hmm, actually I'm just not sure about a lot of things. <laughs> if you hadn't noticed quite yet. Uh, I think I'm gonna hold on to everything over there. I think I'm gonna get rid of the fluffy one, maybe. <coughs> I have three freaking different slime staffs. I'm gonna drink something, because my... Uh, my throat is getting really annoying. That's a new one. Oh. Julia butterfly, tier one. Oh, the used for that one. This is a normal one. Okay. With mean, normal one, I mean like a a normal terrarium one. Okay, um, <clears throat> what else can I make from, from freaking, holy crap, man, <laughs> this stuff looks pretty insane, um, what else can I make for weapons, that's what I was doing, that's what I was doing, the horn staff, I need to get that in the jungle, the meatball staff, don't really know that, butterfly staff too, the harpy rod, which I can't make, I can make the pet, uh, the pet print staff if I, Go and get myself some more penguin feathers. <coughs> Let's go and do that. Um, so, as long as I don't get any freaking rain, I will not get the decree to spawn. So I'll have to wait until I get... Well, wait. I'll have to kind of wait for a... Uh, <coughs> for a thingamabob. I'm kind of going to have to wait for a... Uh, for a rain. For a thunderstorm or whatever. It's kind of funny, this world it used to like always be in the rain and now it just doesn't want to rain when I need actually need the freaking rain. So I will now go and just fight the freaking mother brain. Or the rain of Cthulhu. The mother brain. There you go. Let's go and drink my iron potion. My iron skin potion. I'm gonna need bombs. <laughs> because of course I'm gonna need bombs. Where are you? There you are. Okay, I'm gonna go into the crimson, and I'm gonna go and break some, break some freaking hearts. <laughs> break some hearts, yeah. Sure. Celeste, the heartbreaker. The soul breaker, yeah. <laughs> okay. All right. There you go. I was. I had. I had to blow my nose <laughs> a lot of times. Oh, hello. You are a butterfly. An amph, an amethyst, an amethyst, an amethyst, an amethyst butterfly. But you are not any of the vanilla butterflies, so you are useless to me. It's now use. Yeah. Right, let's go make some platforms and see about making myself. Making myself. Myself in a, a little arena here. Uh, Alright. Let me go and equip the. Gizmo pack. Just because it goes faster. Is the reason why I'm holding on to this thing. There we 
There we go. I think I should be good, though. Let's go and place down torches. This crimson is amazing, though. Because when I need to farm, this room is already big enough for me to just farm the living shit out of any enemy in this area. <laughs> yes, I am placing torches down by random because I have unlimited freaking torches. I find it really handy when the crimson is like connected, like when there are two of these caves connected to each other. I'm sorry, three of them <laughs> this time. That makes that makes it really handy for me. Alright, I will just instantly go into the battle because why in hell wouldn't I? Wait. Get over here. Which is still just an amethyst one. Um Alright. That the rotted four, okay. It's a fork in the road, isn't it? Ripa. Ouch. Well isn't this lovely that there's a freaking there are freaking mob spawning in the middle of the boss battle. I love the poison on all of the enemies. Wait, I should probably switch back to my iron enchantment. <laughs> Alright, now time for the brain himself or herself or itself. Just gotta continue avoiding it. Ooh. That's the only job I have as a summoner. Just avoid the enemies and let, let the kids do the work. Not sure if I had everybody's fun. Well, there you go. <laughs> Done! Nailed it! Alright, cool. Let's go and use the paper tubes to get some more things and let's get the hell out. Alright, um. Of course, you're gonna continuously play Counter Strike like you just freaking yesterday. Uh, Amethyst can go in there. I have a rod of fork, which I can use to make the crimson enchantment, of course. <coughs> it all has a freaking use. Uh, the spinal slayer, or splayer, I'm sorry. The spinal slayer. Oof. Uh, torn notes, those are pretty dang important for me to figure out how to do the end stuff again. Since I constantly forget. Uh, Let's go and do this. Crimson tokens. There you go. Uh, torn note can go into the random ball shite. Let's go and give this uh, eye of heart, of, eye of heart of brain, of Cthulhu, <laughs> to uh, our good old friend over here, wherever he may be. Hello. Wait. Where the hell is? Since when do I have the architect? And where the hell is Josh? Did Josh die? No. Wait, are you in the tree? No. Where is this guy? He's a freaking bald adventurer looking dude. How can I lose him? I don't have any in my inventory somewhere, right? I don't think so. That's weird. Well, at least I have you now. That's really nice. You can buy basically everything from this guy. All kinds of blocks. I can buy desert fossils <laughs> and I can buy obsidian. Uh, I'm not gonna do that though. Not yet. And even still, I'm not, I'm not sure if I'm ever gonna do it. But I can technically get it right now though. I can technically go and collect it. I need, I need to find this dude because I need to... Where is he? He's over here, like, merging with the decorationist. <sighs> Freaking NPCs in Terraria. They all do this. Alright, screw it. I'm gonna bug at you. Get over here. Freaking idiot. There you go. Good job taking down a brain of Cthulhu. Strange how it all uh, how it also has a heart in it. You know these spores, uh, the, those spores in the underground jungle? Well, I saw the I saw what seems to be where they came from. It's this big angry plant thing with some kind of shell. Go to the underground jungle and kill it. Sure. Let's go and kill some random, uh, some random, freaking life. 
Strike an enemy with a melee weapon, inflicts life rent. Killing an enemy with life rent will heal you for 4% of max HP. Corrupt. Strike an enemy with melee weapon. This is all melee stuff, so yeah. Actually, this is just a useless to me in general, so I'm just gonna sell it. Hello? Uh, oh, yeah, right. Uh, have this. Now, did I do the thing for. No, th these are actually just finding uh, special enemies, I think. Yeah, probably. Uh, <coughs> I cannot use any of these two, so I'm just gonna bench them. Let's open my treasure bag and get myself the stalker, which is used to make the whispering enchantment. Man, <laughs> I'm making enchantments like this. I I'm actually really thinking like, should I? Should I really make all of this enchantment stuff? I'm really thinking about it actually, if I should. Hmm. Weird. Uh, well, the reason why I'm thinking that I'm not, why I'm not 100% sure about doing all this stuff is because I'm gonna be doing other playthroughs where I'm gonna be collecting stuff like this, and I'm like, hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Well, in the other playthroughs, I don't really think I will be making any enchantments. Yeah, this is the only playthrough where I'm gonna do that. Uh, why? Because I'm flipping insane, that's why. Okay, let me go and take these things out of here and drop them in here. Okay, this is the weapon chest. Let's go and make another weapon chest. The Brain of Cthulhu uh, can be used in the Colossus Soul. The Worm Scarf can be used in the Cape of the Survivor, which can then be used in the Colossus Soul. <laughs> Woohoo. Alright, I will probably. Can I switch this thing just like this? Yes. There you go. I'm just gonna make a worm scar. Am I gonna equip it somewhere? Yeah, I think I'm gonna equip it instead of this little bugger. There you go. Uh, shackles. Hmm. I'll hold on to them for now. Let's go and get my. Uh, what's it called? My Grimtain. <coughs> and I might. I think I can make a, uh, a summon weapon. With the Crimson Shenanigans, mayhaps. Hmm. Um, wait. I can upgrade this thing. Yeah, sure. So, with this in your inventory, you have a moderate chance not to consume poison. Allows to use potions from PD Bank by. Yeah, by Quick Buff, yes. Alchemist Brewer and Young Brewer are providing 25% discounts. Okay, now. How do I make. This summon weapon that I saw? Or was it this stuff? The spirit trapper stuff? No. No, 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 it was this, the eerie stuff. I need some vertebra. Some vertebra. Uh, there it is. And bam. Eerie cane. Summons a mini chimera to fight for you. So apparently, for some kind of a reason, um, our little Celeste friend <laughs> has decided that it was a good idea to make a Chimera a pet. And yeah, now she has a Chimera as a pet. Woohoo. Uh, strange plant. I have a lot of freaking gold, actually. There you go. 19 damage. But what does this... What does it do though? One, two, three. You can only summon three, right? Yeah. Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. Um, what can I get rid of? I guess that for now. These things can go to the wall, which makes them a lot better than the other thing. Uh, I can see butterflies and I want to catch them. <laughs> yes, this has become my playthrough right now, by the way. Just catching random butterflies. That one's new. Daybloom. This one's from Thorium. Yeah. Yeah. 
Hello, good sir. Strange man, thank you. More reflective obsidian, the same. Kinda sucks. Okay, uh, throw you in the critters. Alright, um. Uh, so the eerie stuff, I need bones for that. Okay. I still. I, I don't have. A, there's no rain. <laughs> there's no rain. So the next thing I'm supposed to do is go and beat the uh, spore mother in the jungle. Let's go and uh, do that then, I guess. Wait, can I upgrade my armor? I don't think so. When is the dread pumpkin? Or the flaming pumpkin? That's quite far away. Ugh. No, not summon, sorry. It's mini that you have to rise. Summon you won't really get far without. There's the B stuff, meteor. If I'm lucky, but the meteor falls down. Uh, Hellstone. That's the necro stuff, which needs bones. Spider, which is hard mode. Uh, the eerie stuff. Ah, wait. I can make eerie armor set. Okay. I can I can make eerie armor set. I'll go and do that then. Ah, they work like those. Okay, they don't stick to enemies; they charge. Intriguing. Okay, I need some vertebra, so I'm gonna go into the caves and I'm gonna just farm over there. I also need a book for that, fuck. Hmm, you know what, I think, I think I've had enough for today. I think I'm gonna stop playing. No, oh, I'm too sick for this. 